What's going on, D-listers? Jimmy 719 here, and today we are playing some more J.J. Mon Story Cyber Sleuth episode 9, I believe. <laughs> How about the Kyoko? What's on your mind, Mama? Why in the world is it so cold inside Broadway? Is something wrong with the AC? If you're not doing anything, find out what's going on. Okay. Can do. Can do. So c cool, it's a little better here, at least. Really? Back entrance? Hmm. Could it be on this floor or what? So. Apparently, we were having a bit of issues in our cases. <laughs> we, we had to find out what was going on. Hmm. <clears throat> First, we had to find out about. Some terrible hackers that are misusing their Digimon is huge no-no. And also, a, a Digimon, of all things, was was actually giving uh, a a phone app some problems. Apparently, it was a virus, which turned out the virus was a Digimon. Is crazy in its own way. Could you imagine if all these viruses, these bugs that we get from the video games now, what if they were, what if they are Digimon? Think about that for a minute. Let that, let that settle into your head, you listeners. <laughs> oh, it's f f f f freezing here. Did the AC break or something? Okay, well, for some reason there's giving me the option to cyber jump. Well, let's go ahead. Let's go in. Let's go in and see what's going on. Jury girl. What the hell? What the hell? Huh? Her voice cut out. I wonder what's up. Oh, uh, that is creepy. What the hell is that? Me again. I've got a new case for you. Why don't you drop on by so we can talk? Oh. The hell? It just stopped, guys. The hell's going on? A dreary girl, now all of a sudden. We're getting calls for new cases. What the hell's going on? I was just doing... Okay, I have to check the build from board huh? Time capsule, Snow Woman. Mysterious digital face. Ma? Broadway management. There's something wrong with the air conditioning of Broadway, but in the cause. Yeah, I think I found what the cause is. It's some girl that's in the AC. Okay, guys, as soon as I got about to jump, the stray girl had to go in there and. Uh, it's a little bit serious. Let's find out what's going on. Time capsule, Snow Woman. From what I gathered, air conditioning inside Nuck Nuck on Broadway is on the fritz. It just keeps pumping in cold air constantly, and nobody can switch the heating on. Thing is, nobody can find anything wrong with it, and the business is are lost about what to do. Are you saying we're lost too, Mama? That's where we come in. People aren't getting much work done, so I told them to leave it to us. If we can get to the bottom of this mess, I'm sure they'll just live us forever for it. Oh, it's that girl again, guys. 
the hell? I see my cold air going through. Dot, dot, dot. Huh? You keep getting transmissions from someone? Hmm? Oh, is she a cutie? <laughs> the white noise in this is really bad. I can't make out what she's saying. Where's this coming? Whoa. Saying the same transmission came in where it was cold? Hmm. It might be closing in on the cause. Hmm. If so, our next step is to resolve this thing. Plain and simple. I want to see if I can figure out the signal's origin. You ask around about the air conditioning. Okay. Okay, now all of a sudden. This mysterious call from this mysterious girl, and all you could hear is the wind going through. I don't tell it could go or not, guys. Ask around. Let's ask around, huh? No? You want us to talk? Okay. Ever. He's at the top of it and he starts at the reef. Okay, it's the same thing. How about floor three? Anything different? Okay, it's all the same thing. It's all the same thing, guys. It's all the same thing, dealers. Go home. Uh oh. Getting closer, guys. I think. I need to do that. No, it's not it. Floor floor. So there's anything different? No. What's about this one? Where is it going? Probably such an interesting one. Oh. So you're telling me that Broadway. It's also an apartment upstairs. So I'm gonna do just that. Talk to you soon. Mirror is right. There is lots we don't know about each other. Let's talk more. Alright. Your friends. Your family, guys. Gotta always be there for your family. How's the kids going? I'll be by the summit. Good luck. So I'll get it, guys. So I, I've been through there already. Let's see. She shot myself for it. This cafe on the floor for oh, this building is a maze. I better check the shop with spy elevators. It's weird. It feels cold, but when I check the thermometer, it's gone down or anything. That is weird, guys. That is weird. I would eat, but there were so many hackers that I quit. Is it still like that? Yeah, there's plenty of hackers. Let's talk to one just now. Talk to you? 
Oh, here, here. Don't you? No. Okay, one metal for it. Do again? No, right now. We're on. We're gonna catch guys. We can't be getting medals just yet. Oh, just go in here. The truth go the wrong way on this clear. The. I'll go on in. Let's see. These guys don't feel that. Let's see. Oh, uh, we got a fire floor. Okay. Let's go back downstairs. See, can I talk to you? This looks awful shady. Most of the time, the consolation room has no salt with Steven in business. You say anything? No. Will you say anything? Oh, God. How can I help you? Capsule escape the export. T. No. I don't even know that just yet. I always sound so tired. Let's see, do you have anything here? Why have you worn off and got lost? Sorry, looks that way. I don't know time. Perhaps you should get back to your real job. Sorry, Steve. Hee hee. Get lost again. Take back. I lost time. What? Oh. I think I've talked to almost everyone, right? I'll be managing to get solid. Look. Hey, so, how the heck am I supposed to? To live by. <laughs> if it rides over to spirits, it's a kara holy land for us nerds. <sighs> okay, Bara, excuse me. I apologize. Now it's a lot safer to come here to Nekonol. You can get some culture back at any place. <laughs> I did. This is a great selection of comics and mechanics, and the one I wanted to come out today. <laughs> I didn't know, okay. <laughs> On to the next floor, guys. Sorry for dreaming you. Have a good reason. Yeah. Yeah. You wanna, you wanna know how the AC broke? Beats me. I have no idea. Now, okay, cafe owner. You perv. What the hell good are you? It's odd. We don't have a central unit anymore. So, how could everyone's AC go out? Huh? You don't know about the central unit? No, oh, tell me. More. Back when this place first opened. There was a big underground unit that controlled the AC for the whole building. Damn. That's pretty neat. Sure feels like the old central unit going out. 
The way it worked was that every store circulated that cool air up to their stores of fans. Damn. All that cold air with fans, huh? That, and it goes through the entire freaking building. Can you imagine that? Four, four buildings just for stores, agencies. And on top of that, even more buildings for apartments. That's just crazy. And that unit controlled the whole the whole building. The entire thing. Agencies, stores, and apartments. That's pretty damn impressive. Is it on the ground at all? Well, that was to refrigerate a certain something. <laughs> what do you think it was? <laughs> it was Japan's oldest vacuum tube computer. Can you leave it? Vacuum tube computer? What? The room that computer was housed in was right here in Nikonol. Sad to say, I have no idea what happened to it. There's nothing left of it anymore. And even if there were, there were, there are no records left. Nobody remembers where it was either. The room itself might as well be an urban legend. Really? A vacuum computer, guys. Shit sounds crazy. I can tell you one thing, it's very cold, although it's done wonders for coffee sales today. <laughs> of course you're happy about it. I figured out where that signal came from. So get back into the office when you can, alright? Okay, yeah, well, let's do that. Nice work with your investigation. Now what have you got to report? Apparently that's huge ass second computer. And then how it controls this whole that building. Maybe we just whole damn city. Who knows? Who knows, guys? Hmm. This is the first I've heard of that computer room. But with that info, it's all starting to click for me now. Like I mentioned before, I figured out who the girl in those transmissions is. And who? Her name's Fuyumi Yuki. She was a breakout idol from a few decades back. Decades back. What do you mean by that? Miss Kyoko. I'm interested in finding out. Decades ago, huh? The hell? Well, we've been seeing the avatar on the screen as her when she was in her prime as an idol. Somebody is therefore using a terminal inside Nikon Broadway and broadcasting her likeness. Like a ghost, maybe? And the signal seems to be coming from the fourth floor. Yeah? Okay, okay. paid out like a horror story, hasn't it? A long lost idol relaying her message from inside the wall. Yeah, this is pretty goddamn scary, guys. Pretty damn spooky. With your report, it's all coming together now. You've uncovered a piece of Nakum Broadway history that not even the owner of K Cafe has to go to a store and could claim to know. Oh, she's all impressed about that. <laughs> but enough talk, it's time to head back to K Cafe. I'll be coming along for this one, too. I'm oh, about to get to the bottom of this, guys. Let's get to the bottom of this. I'm gonna find out today what's going on. <laughs> Alright, now let's get going. Let's get going. I got a message from a girl, and when I answered it, it got cold all of a sudden. It's the snow woman. She's cursed us. It has to be her. Snow woman? Uh oh. Alright. Can't hardly believe it, but it definitely has been really ch chilly in here. Got bad film about this. Maybe I'll just go home. Oh, driving away business. Or the snow woman is running our business. <clears throat> huh, the snow woman. The MO sure does fit with the folktale, though. You know, idol's name Fuyumi Yuki means winter snow woman. Fuyumi Yuki means winter snow woman. Really? 
Learn something new every day, D-listers. How about that? Snow Woman herself shows up in a lot of stories from regions with cold climates. Definitely the first time she's taken from an old 80s idol. But it's pretty fitting for Neko and Broadway, all things considered. <laughs> I see. I, I just like how you're taking the best out of this. Kyoko, you're... Yeah. I think you had too much of your coffees. I think you had a little bit too much of your own coffees. You're a special blend. It's getting to you finally. Still, if we don't act quickly, she's going to damage this place's reputation. So let's get a move on already. Oh, she has, she's a partner? No. Okay. She's following us, huh? Those long strides she takes. Jeez. This is it. The transmission should be coming from the other side from here. Yet, yeah, there's no door, and there are no signs of the wall being tampered with. What's going on here? Uh oh. A dreary girl. It's Kyoko. It's Kyoko. You seen this too? Another for transmission? That just about confirms we're in the right spot then. Right? Exactly. I don't. I don't like the looks of this. Uh oh. What the hell? Oof! Oh, did anyone else get sun chill just now? Oof! Goodness. Think she's in here with us, guys? Think she's in here with me in this room? <laughs> yeah, like for real, I just gotten freezing with that. That earth sound, even? It's like she's noticed us trying to meddle with her. Now it's even colder. You're probably less affected by your tricks thanks to your new unique body. Oh, yeah, that's right. We have a cyber body, guys. I f forgot about that. We could probably to fill a damn thing. But we're not filling a damn thing. Hmm? Oh, did you find something? Yeah. What is it? I'd like to know. I see. So there's an entry point in cyberspace inside that wall. Don't worry about me. You go ahead and get in there. Alright, we'll do. Cyber jab! Oh, guys, I'm... Am I in that vacuum computer? Maybe? Fireball. Let's see. Get our clock now. We're gonna find out who the snow woman is. Or just get for another trap. Let's keep going. I'll keep going, D lifters. Let's find out the truth. Oh. That's where we just were, guys. <gasps> the hell? Baby time. This is a level two. Listen. I don't know about this guy's. I don't know. I just don't know. What do you think about this guy's? Walk it home. I'll just miss him. I don't know. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I had to go down that way. It's a little tense. <laughs> Sorry, come on, you have to see that. Let's see if we can find out what's going on, guys. Is this the same? No, it can't be. Is it? Coromon. And Sumamon. Alright, let's see. Sorry, Sumo. Sorry, Sumo. Sorry, you have to go down that way. Sorry, Chroma. I apologize profusely. I apologize profusely, guys. Hey, y'all have to get taken down that way. They right. It's real. It's real. Let's fell off. Chroma and 
so I want to get him. The plot thickening guys, or what's going on? Why do they seem to be the ones that keep popping up? I don't know. That's creepy as fuck. That's creepy as fuck. What, did, what do they have to do with uh, snow? Oh. What the hell? Come on. The virus. The virus type. Back in Digimon the movie. Remember him. Shit, sir. I don't know why that, that scared me a little bit, that gave me a jump as soon as I seen her. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Alright, let's go. Come on, guys. Come on, family. Let's go. Oh, I'm sorry. Just ran right into her. That was pretty quick. You came. Thank you. What the hell? Please, help me. What the hell? Wait, man, what the hell? <sighs> oh my god! Frigima, what the hell? Colder. It's not cold enough. Not until everyone is frozen. What the hell? <clears throat> I'm your giant again. Did you want it, you? Frigi. Damn! Bro, Twister, come on, let's go. Burn him down. Go hide your water. God dang. Oh, he's weak. He's weak. Come on, come on, let's go. Here you go. Here you go, come on, here you go. Aura. Oh. More farm twisters. Magic attack. Let's try that. I don't know. You sleeping, guys? Oh, I got him to sleep. Attack is a trap. I was trying to get poison ivy. Oh, it works. It works, guys. Sleep. Stay sleeping. Stay sleeping. Oh, woke up. Oh, it works. Drop your mind. Drop your mind. You sit strong, yeah. You sit strong, be Good job. Good job. That's what we need. That's what we need. Fredjamon just spit the dust, guys. He's down. Mental charge. Oh, she is kind of the smartest Digimon, I think. From from the shows, from the show, the anime, the first season, she is the first smart one. With her partner Sora, I mean, they were smart, smart ones in the group. Boy, it was so cold. Thanks for taking care of him. That was one nasty glitch. Glitch. <laughs> Nasty glitch, what? On your mom. You saved the day. Really? You must have come over when you heard my voice, right? Your girl or what the You didn't? It? You're a cyber sleuth working the case? I don't really get it. But whatever. All's well that ends well. Fake mom's rampaging really did cause so much trouble. What? How the hell? Huh? Who am I? Well, to be honest, I don't know myself. I've been stuck asleep inside this wall the whole time, you see. Come on, come on. Obviously.
That's crazy though, guys. Vegemon. A Digimon was causing the air to get colder. Hanyamon just called him a glitch. That's pretty interesting. Hey, I'm trying to stop the one cold air here. Great job. You did so much, you must be tired. It would have been a real sad state of affairs if we had somehow managed to freeze to death here in Tokyo, of all places. <laughs> you found a cat Digimon with amnesia? I used to solve one mystery, only solve one to another. It seems. Come back here and we'll look into it. Okay. An, an amnesiac Digimon, huh? Every time I think I've seen everything, I get it proven wrong yet again. I take it those transmissions from Fuyumi and Yuki for your doing them? <clears throat> yep. Yep, I wasn't able to move around once Frigidmon started going crazy. So I had to call for help somehow and I sent out those messages. Well, I did come from a vacuum tube computer inside a wall. Whoa, guys. Vacuum tube computer inside a wall. Duh. Are the urban legends true then? A giant computer controls the whole... whole country? The whole city, maybe? And that means the vacuum tube computer was really there behind the wall this whole time? <laughs> I've been asleep inside a computer for a really long, long time. I only woke up just recently. And when I did, I had no idea who I was, or what I was doing inside the wall. So I decided to go and see what I could learn. Ow. Sorry, I just had to do that, guys. <laughs> that was when I stumbled upon an internet connecting the vacuum tube computer to the rest of the building. <clears throat> internet? I mean, networking lines that only operate inside a cone, probably? Yeah, so... As I was just playing around, I was when Frigidmon suddenly appeared. It was originally a Digimon that was created as a result of a glitch in the air conditioning system. A Digimon that was created as a result of a glitch. <laughs> yeah, like I said guys, this Digimon was ahead of its time to me. Back there, like, <clears throat> there's no such. Well, maybe there was such thing as glitches and everything, but sorry, I'm, I'm an old school person. I play the PlayStations. If my game did start, <laughs> you know the. <sighs> five seconds. If it didn't work, there was something wrong with it. <laughs> so I had to clean it up. Turn sideways, clean it up, nice and clean, stick it back into a PlayStation, turn it on, and see if it works. <laughs> but nowadays, yeah, with all the, these new video games coming out, all these bugs we're finding, all these glitches, all these hacks, all it might be. Might be Digimon, guys. You never know. You never know. Come to the story. I see. It all makes sense now. That must have been why nobody could find anything wrong with the system when they hacked it. When they checked it. Frigimon just went completely insane. Oh, my bad. Frigimon just went completely insane. I won't, I won't listen to me. Eventually, I couldn't even move with all that constant cold. It was terrible. I had no idea. It's hard to believe such an old computer was even still operational to begin with, too. Was, but its existence is probably rem, remnant of the centralized AC system the K Cafe owner mentioned before. The wiring must have been hooked up pretty poorly for Frigidmon to be able to wreck such havoc then. Okay, so there was a reason why he turned. He went mad then. Okay. And therein lies the root of how this all managed to happen. Something was gone, gone wrong with his 
connection. Uh, he went mad. Okay. I imagine even our conversation right now must be going through the internet as well. By the way, is there a reason why he chose to appear as an idol in those tragic missions? Why? She was just cute, I guess. <laughs> right? Oh, shit. She fooled me. Um. It's simple. I just thought someone cute like her would make someone want to come in and help me. Uh oh. She's pissed. For you, Mayuki, simply because, well, she was amazing when she was really popular. She could sing, she could dance, and her looks for you, May, had everything you could want in an idol. Oh, yeah! Who <laughs> <laughs> said Digimon can't be perfect, guys? <laughs> he seems excited. He seems like a pervy sage to me. There was also a world's fair around the time her career was really starting to take off. There was such a long line for the moon rocks. Wait, why do I remember that? I don't even know my own name. I think I get what's going on here. It looks like we've, un we've uncovered decades old time capsule. Time cap- Time capsule? What's that? Your memories aren't just raw bits of information. They're more than that. They have a certain humanity to them, let's say. I bet you're somebody's old memory stashed away along with the vacuum tube computer you've been living in. That's what time capsules are for. <laughs> That's what I am? One of mods just someone's memories? <laughs> that they're reliving? Memories are not. But memories are not. That doesn't make you any less empathetic a creature to encounter. What? Either way. This case is wrapped up now. We'll look into what's up with this, this cat Digimon later. Truly, there's no other place quite like Nikono. Nikono. Investigation of Time Capsule Snow Woman. Complete. Report back to the detective agency. Eh? Apparently, this Snow Woman was a Digimon this whole time, huh? That's crazy. Turned out, the problem with the air was not... There was nothing wrong with AC. Just a Digimon that's gone mad. Which is apparently a glitch. That's... <laughs> wow. Like I keep saying, Digimon, <laughs> like it or not, was ahead of its time. I mean, like... Especially when Pokemon was such a huge deal. Still is. Still is. Don't get me wrong, I'm... I'm still enjoying the video games. I'm still buying them. No worries. <laughs> but I also enjoy Digimon 2. No worry. That's why I'm playing this. That's why I'm playing this. It's a good game. All in all, so far. All in all, it's a very amazing game. I'm glad that they got to come back after such a long time absence. Hopefully, it could keep going for a longer time. For back to the taste range, see. It's no one. Okay. Quiz time. Your glove has two marks. A circle and... <coughs> hint. Also on shirt. What is it? The X? Okay, let's go across. It's an X though. Alright, we'll just say it's a cross because that works with me. <coughs> I just have a good look. You were just with me! We finished it! Right, put a step on it, guys. We're done. It's done. Come starter. Become a starter cyber stiff. Jinpai. Dude, evolved to two, uh, starter cyber sleuth. All right, how about that?
still, you have a real knack for getting us involved in a lot of stuff. So thanks for always keeping that interest in around here. No problem, miss. No problem, mama. No problem. You're free? What are you talking about? Detectives don't have free time. Fine. Here's just a test for you. Figure out what you should be doing. Oh, no! Okay, I'll go with them jokes. Miss Kyoko go with them jokes. <laughs> Alright, guys. Not... I think I'm going to leave this episode here. If you guys enjoyed it, please leave a like. Let me know what you think of the video down in the comment section below. Subscribe to become a dealer today. See y'all.